this fucking beat drop, you already know what fucking time it is. Daily Dose is on now. Check it out, y'all. Now, the pressure was on last night because the last presidential debate happened, and I must say, un aplauso for both candidates because they behaved better than last time. Prisma, you don't think they, they did a good job? They think, still throw a shot. But they're not talking over Lincoln, each other. Mr. Lincoln. They're not talking over each other like we do usually yeah, on the show. I just, the bar was set so low, mm-hmm. so like because of the, the first one. So like at least they didn't do this. But let's be clear, like they still didn't address much. Now no. shout out to Miss Kristen Welker who was the moderator, and I think she did an amazing job and kept the gentleman in line. Now they talked about <laughs> COVID, racism, immigration, yeah. uh, climate change, and the biggest part for me was when they answered the immigration problem with the kids who are separated from their parents. This is what Donald Trump had to say. Our children are brought here by coyotes and lots of bad people, cartels, and they're brought here and they used to use them to get into our country. We now have as strong a border as we've ever had. We're over 400 miles of brand new wall. You see the numbers and we let people in, but they have to come in legally and they come in through But Merit. how will you reunite but let me these just tell kids you, with their families, let me just tell you, Mr. President? They built cages. You know, they used to say, I built the cages. And then they had a picture in a certain newspaper and it was a picture of these horrible cages and they said look at these cages president trump built them and then it was determined they were built in 2014 that was him do you have a plan to reunite the kids yes we're working on it very we're we're trying very hard but a lot of these kids come out without the parents they come over through cartels and through coyotes and through gangs and this is what mr biden had to say Hmm. 500 plus kids came with parents They separated them at the border to make it a disincentive to come to begin with. Bay, real tough. We're really strong. And guess what? They cannot, it's not coyotes didn't bring them over. Their parents were with them. They got separated from their parents. And it makes us a laughing stock and violates every notion of who we are as a nation. Do I like their response? No. But at least they responded it the way they think and how they feel. So it definitely cleared up some things that I needed to clear up. I just wasn't expecting Donnie to bring up the (laughs) fact that, yo, listen, I might use the cages, but you made the cages. But either way, I mean, they're they're all wrong. And these kids should not be locked up. Uh, But it was crazy to see, like, yo, Biden... You were still part of that administration that mm-hmm. made those cages. And, of course, Bi- uh, Biden's rebuttal was, hey, fam, you're using them. And you got a, you got rid of Catch and Release, which mm-hmm. was a program that helped a lot of people that were seeking asylum in the United States. Either way, look, you don't got to agree with Trump. You don't got to agree with Biden. I just think the most important thing is you got to go vote. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you have to vote. This is the most important election of Crazy. all time. And it's insane that we are looking at two men who are in their 70s talking about Black Lives Matter issues and kids in the cages at the border Crazy. but this is what we got these are the options that we have now and we have to decide because this is going to dictate the future the next couple of years so it's important go out there and exercise your rights it's to going vote. down to history go vote go now vote. i vote for cardi b and offset yeah, to be prom too. queen and king yeah. because they were on live and he was asking her for some you know which is normal in a married couple i know when he's like get up come on i want to have breakfast now. That's what you call it? Oh, yeah, I call it. You want to eat? Oh, wow. <laughs> but Dude, but does not... he do it on the live? Does your husband do it on the live? No, he does not. But on the live, Offset was making fun of Cardi. Here's what he said. Dad, my breath is out. I done seen them titties before. Hey, we done seen them titties, titties before. Hey, we done seen, seen them titties before. before. God, man, man, uh-huh. I seen them. Hey, man, I seen them. Hey, and you it's know what? Cardi. I think that's part of, that's a great drop. I think it's part of a great relationship. Whatever works for you, man. If you guys kid around like that, you guys jab at each other, I think that shows like some form of a healthy relationship. I know everyone criticizes them, but look how much fun they have uh, when they're together. You listen, know if you can't have fun y'all. with your partner and you can't make fun of yourself with your partner, then who the hell are you going to do it with? And let's be clear, I'm sure Cardi roasts Offset. <laughs> like, she don't play around. We know this from past experiences. She's from New York, She baby. don't play. So, kudos to them. Keep doing what y'all do. If you or anybody you may know has been a victim of Cardi B, please call 818-520-1059. And if you want to know what we're talking about, here's the link down below. Of, they deleted uh, it. They did? Yeah. Never Shout mind. Shout out to everyone who knows. If you know, you know. Because they deleted it from here. But if you Google it, it'll probably come out. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> now, Miss Summer Walker is single, Ooh. ready to mingle, and she posted it on Instagram. Hey. Single. She's and single again. Go ahead, Summer. Now, she said, eventually, you have to give some kind of fuck about yourself. <laughs> she also said, it's the bare minimum for me. I don't know about posting it, though. Like, she just... I have an announcement to make. Well, Everybody I mean, listen up. All the dudes waiting in line want to know. That's True. what I'm saying. I True. think that's what it is. I think this goes against everything that I believed in as a human being my whole life. I always thought like, yo, why are you oversharing? We don't need to know. But then I thought about it. Mm. I said, how is anybody going to shoot this shot out of Summer Walker? If you don't know Summer Walker mm. single, you got to know, announce. And for Summer <laughs> Walker, once you feel like you ready, let them know. Because, you know, it's nothing worse as a fella. Fella, let's be real. Go into to a girl's page and be like, I don't know if she's single or Listen, not. So I'm lying. not going to shoot my shot. No, no, no. You're lying because, fellas, you know. Us women know as well. You know when a girl is single or taken. Why? Because she posts quotes. Because she's out <laughs> with her friends. Because she. there are so many other ways to So know. many signs. Yes. If a woman is single... No. Then, then to post you, it. You're referring to the uh, women uh, prior to 2017. This newly evolved female uh, oh, okay. has learned and has modified, and we can't tell anymore. Therefore, I think it's extremely important if you know what I'm saying to let me know when you when you on the market again. Uh, I want to know. You I want to know if that. I want to go shopping. Charisma. I need to know. You Are you gonna let them know if you're single or taken? I uh, no. By you the way, you won't even be able to tell. DJ Charisma. You won't even be able to tell. I work. Single. There you go. I, is she? She's single. Is she? <laughs> Stop. And she's Y'all ready. see the green out here looking like a sexy lemon. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> a little lime. A little bugger. Come holla at Charisma. She's single. But we'll bring it back. Where's my camera? Is it here or is it here? Boom. Do you believe that you should announce to the whole world nope. on social media that you are single again? Comment down below. Mm-mm. Let them know. Hey, listen. This, 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 this right here, it's on the market again. <laughs> Comment down below. Do you need to announce Holla. to everybody that you are single? It is the daily dose. We out here. Bam. Gang, gang. When this fucking beat drop, you already know what fucking time it is. Now. Check it out, y'all.